This is the Brunsviga 90TA. It's a simple adding machine with a full keyboard and it's very easy to use. You can enter a number on the keyboard, the keys uh, stay pressed down. The number you've entered can be read off on the input register here at the bottom. There's a huge lever on the side and if you push that down the number you've entered gets added to the main register at the top. The main register has nine digits. The keyboard is automatically cleared so that you can then enter the next number to add. You can also subtract. There's a minus button here on the right. You may have noticed that the main register shifted to the right a little bit. That's because the uh, register is, uh, is then reconnected to the rest of the mechanism through uh, one less intermediate gear so that the number wheels turn the up other way around. Uh, if you subtract uh, a number so that the register becomes negative, it will obviously underflow, so you see all these leading nines here. But there's a, a nice feature where you can shift this window so that it reads off what the number should really be, so it's now minus 22,222. So when I'm in this negative mode I can say add 5 and it actually reduces this number because it's now negative 22,217. Um, there's a small issue though with this system that is, if the number ends, ends in a zero, you have to do something slightly special. Because, yeah, this final zero really stands for a 10. It has a red dot in the middle to show it's not a normal zero. It's really a 10. So the number shown here is now 22,210, not just 200. Uh, to clear the register you use this uh, asterisk button, you press it and push the lever. Uh, this R button here, that's to uh, repeat. When that is uh, pressed down it means that whatever you input doesn't get cleared when you add or subtract it from the main register. So you can add it several times in succession just by pumping the lever. So in this way you can do small multiplications. To clear the input in this case you can use this C button. This C button can also be used if you want to uh, clear the input before you've added something. And that's really all there is to it. Um, I'll, uh, I'll open it up in a moment. Let me just first show you the underside. It, right there it has a small badge saying the Brunsviga 90TA. And there is the serial number. You may have seen I've already removed some screws from the bottom, so it's uh, so I can uh, undo the case. Also remove this small red top on this slide. There we go. And now the top, sh the top of the casing should just lift off. There we go. 
I'll put this back on. This machine uses uh, uh, toothed racks and if I enter a number you can see how it works. These racks they move backwards so uh, the register lifts off first the racks move back however far uh, you've uh, You've entered on the input uh, keyboard and then the register drops down and the, the racks move back and that adds that number to the uh, register and subtracting you'll see that the whole register shifts to one side slightly And when it drops down, it's now connected through uh, without uh, using an intermediate gear. And um, yeah, this this machine it was invented by uh, Siegfried Link. At first, he made them uh, for the uh, company uh, called Comet. And that, this was in 1952 or 53, but that company. Uh, went bust in 1955 and then Brunsviga uh, bought all the rights to this machine. They bought all the available stock that, and uh, sold those on and then uh, Secret Link continued to produce them for Brunsviga. Production ended around 1958 or 9 and uh, yeah about uh, 8,000 or so were made for, uh, for Brunsviga. So that was the Brunsviga 90TA. Thank you for watching.